This is the ice scraper located on the very bottom of your snow throw. The part number is 76322V10020. They sell for about $12. You could purchase a kit for about $50 and change. You get the auger, the belt, and the blade. It's located on the very bottom. So what I am going to do is reverse the snow thrower. And tilt it up. And maybe we'll be able to get it this particular way. It's going to probably be using a 12 millimeter bolt. We're going to take a 12 millimeter bolt. Lefty loosey, righty tidy. I am going to remove this. Show you that this is the new one compared to the old one. And we'll inspect it as we pull it off. There are no holding parts on the other side. So simply loosen them up. They're not super tight. Show you how tight they are. That's not tight at all, but you can see I need to still use my hand tool to get them off. Now, what you're going to do is simply lift away. Look at the old one and the new one. And you can see the bottom, how it's scraped apart and all torn apart. Don't throw this away. You still can use it. Save it as a spare part. Get yourself a rag. Might as well clean up the area. Get all the dirt, anything away. If it needs to be sprayed, primed, now's the time to do so. Find the lip that's over here. What you're going to do is grab that lip again, make sure it locks into place. There you go. Just about on there. You can put things on the wrong way and they will still work. The reason why you have a big washer on the back of this is so that it will hold more pressure on the material. There's no metal. It's all plastic. The washer will spread the pressure a little wider than narrower. So now I go righty tighty. I still put my fingers in the back, make sure that it gets on there. And I do the center one now. It's snug. I put a little pressure onto the actual snow throw to the up part. It's snug. And the last one. It's snug. Now I want to make sure I get a nice, tight, firm grip. Not super tight, but tight enough that I know it grabs and holds on the same amount of pressure that it did to take it off. And this will start to bend like the old one. So now I got the whole new icebreaker piece on. Is that piece on the chart? Scraper. 
Scraper blade nut 8 millimeter, 90309428731. Scraper blade washer, 8.5 millimeter, 90521-259000. The scraper blade, 76322, version 10020. So there you have the exact part, the washer, the bolt and a nut in case you need to get new ones. I hope this video was helpful to somebody out there and thank you very much for viewing. Most of this information, ladies and gentlemen, is in the owner's manual to order these parts. You can get replacement parts at a mower or a snow thrower place, Honda. I found mine online, ordered myself a kit, and here I am making videos showing you how simple it is to change out some of the parts of the 520 HS from Honda. Have a great day and see you on the auger video.